Hey there, welcome back. Uh, this is Carrie's uh, Designs by Carrie Ann. And today I would like to try something I've been, I've been wanting to do for quite a while, and that is to paint uh, on my phone case. So I've seen a lot of people try this, and you know, I've had so many paint marks on my case already, I thought, you know, I really just need to do this, and why not make something interesting out of it? So that's my plan today. I've got, um, kind of a more expensive phone case uh, and I'm pretty sure the manufacturer doesn't recommend painting on it but I'm gonna do that <laughs> anyway so uh, that's what I plan to do I've got it sitting here I cleaned it up already um, with just some 99% alcohol just to get any you know grease or oil or even paint off of there um, I set it up and made it level and I've chose my colors I'm kind of wanting to do some blues and some coppers and browns and uh, that's what I'm gonna go for. So, um, yeah, so that's my plan. I'm gonna, let's see what happens. Before I start though, I wanna show you that um, before this phone case, I had made, had a phone case uh, custom made out of one of my earlier paintings. This was an earlier painting that I did and I s uploaded that image to um, Fine Art America and you can, you can get your images on just about anything, just like at um, Zazzle where I got this apron made. You can get your image on anything. So I got my, that image on a phone case, an older phone case, which is this little guy. I was super excited about it and it came out great. Uh, looks exactly like, exactly like my painting. So I was thrilled about that. The only thing is, is that this phone case is not super, super strong. And I dropped my phone while it was in this case. It cracked. I had to get a replacement phone. And so I stopped using this cute little guy and went out and spent the money for a more protective phone case, which is this, this one. And I've been carrying this around and I'm bored with it. And like I said, I've got paint on it. So why not add some more paint? So anyway, here we go. I have chose some colors. I've got some metallic blue. This is an artist loft. Mixed, all of my paints are mixed with Floetrol. No water, no silicone. I've got some aqua green, artist loft. I've got, this is a pre-mixed gray. Um, Artist Loft Flow acrylics, and then a rose gold, which is Deco Art, also mixed with um, Floetrol. So I already put them in my little mini cups. I leveled my um, phone case. I decided not to tape off the holes and port areas on the phone case. I think I'll just have to maybe peel them off afterwards. I don't know, we'll see what happens. So it's just completely free and naked. <laughs> like it'll just, I just ripped it off my phone and cleaned it up and here we go. So I've got these, I made, um, I filled up two little mini cups and hopefully I've got enough paint. It looks like I've got plenty of paint. So let's just flip these guys over and see what we get. I'm a little worried because this phone case is very plastic. I don't know what it's made out of. Obviously it has to be made out of something pretty sturdy because it's supposed to protect your phone. But I'm not sure of how how adhesive it's going to how how well it's going to stick to how well my paint is going to stick to the surface because it is very smooth and it doesn't seem to be very porous. So I'm a little worried about how much coverage I'm actually going to get. But you know what? This is an experiment. Let's see what happens. So far, I like uh, these colors. I tend to sort of go towards blues and browns when I paint, so it made sense that I chose these colors for my phone case. It appears that I've got some uneven distribution here. I did try to level this guy, but it's so tiny and awkward. I don't know how successful I was. So, uh, as usual, I'll let these sit a little bit and kind of squeeze them to see if I can create some suction. Although this, this cup is actually on top of one of the holes where my the camera hole on the back of the phone case. So there's not gonna, I'm not gonna be able to create much suction there, but this guy might be able to. Tappy tap tap, Let's see what happens. Okay, let's open this guy up. Now I see I need to move this paint around because it's not, it's not flowing in the right direction. We can fix that easily, easily enough. Ah, don't move. I created too much suction on this guy. Ooh, look at that. Somehow I got cells out of here. And by the way, I won't be applying any paint to this because, you know, this phone case is made out of some sort of plastic and I don't think that's a real safe idea to start throwing fire at this. 
so I'm gonna forego that. Got too much gray, I see already. I want some more blue, but uh, I might. I'm gonna grab a spoon and see if I can scoop up some of that blue. Put it in the center here where I have so much gray. Oh, if this dries like this, it'll be pretty cool. I'm kind of excited about this. I, To be honest, I was kind of thinking this was going to be a dud experiment, but right now I'm, I'm really pleased. I've been wanting to do this for quite some time, but I didn't want to leave myself without a phone case if I'm in a you know, situation where I could potentially drop my phone and have you know a phone emergency nobody wants that so i think i've timed it well where in the next few days which will allow this to dry i can be uh relatively safe with where i am as far as potential accidents with my phone oh i don't like those stripes all right well let's see here let's touch up the sides It looks like it did pretty good with not um, covering up the ports down on this end anyway. And I am a little worried about, you know, on the side you have buttons. I have an Android, by the way. On the side you have buttons to, um, you know, navigate your phone. And I'm a little bit worried about the paint soaking into those buttons and then the buttons not functioning properly. But, uh, I don't know, we'll see. Again, experiment. Ooh, I like this, I like this. Look at that. Okay, I'm gonna bring you guys in for a little closer look, and then I'm just gonna, I think, sign off, because this was a pretty quick little experiment. Excuse me, the phone's gonna shake a minute. So, here we go. I think it looks pretty cool. Okay. Well, um, that's, that's it. I think I will end up posting this uh, the results on my Instagram if you want to check that out in a few days and um, yeah hopefully and then I'll test it out and make sure that my buttons work like they're like they're supposed to um, and I guess that's that's it thanks for watching if you like my videos please subscribe hit the like button make some comments and come back next time thanks for watching take care